And Fox 2 is your local election headquarters, and with record numbers of absentee ballots being mailed in, we decided to take a closer look at what happens when your ballot gets to the election headquarters. All new at 6, Fox 2's Vic Faust brings you the story from St. Charles County. These are mailed in absentee and early voting ballots in St. Charles County. They are safely stored in the election headquarters absentee vault until they can be counted election day. When you mail your ballot in, it goes to a file room first where it has to be stamped as delivered on time. I have a bipartisan team that just stamps all the mail as date received. Anything that's normal mail, we go ahead and open right away and then process. Anything that's ballots, we then box back up and then take to the absentee so, room. Once separated, the ballots come to the vault. They are not allowed to be touched until this Thursday when they will be prepared to be counted on election day. The white ballots are absentee, the gray our early vote by mail. After we get them is then we'll, we'll divide them up to our different clerks and then we will have them input these ballots into our system. That way we know, okay, th this voter's ballot has been received by us. Once inputted, the ballots are packaged up here together. And for the first time ever, voters can track their ballots once they've mailed them in with a ballot tracking system. There is a link on our website, election.sccmo.org, and then it's the, one of the first links on the, on the main page. Voters put in personal information and track the ballot. And they can see if when it was sent, they can see when it is you know, sent from the vendor to their house, and then when it's received by us, it will show that it's been received by us once it's here. Vic Faust, 